it starts with a script, you know. Uh, in the original novel, Camilla, it's a very incidental character. In this story, Camilla becomes a bigger character. And then um, I observe everything. I'm a, I'm a very hardworking actor in terms of all the intellectual and cerebral work I have to do before I go on set. But once I go on set, I just let go of all that and I just play and enjoy it and let the character take over. You know, so what I do is I really do a lot of uh, groundwork beforehand. I prepare physically for the role because it's a role that requires a woman to look not only strength intellectual, you know, in, in terms of, of intellectual capacity, but also physically. You know, this is a character that lives at the edge, uh, with the edge of the sword, and, and I mean, he can, she can die any moment. She had to run any moment. So that provokes a certain latent uh, stress that the character lives with all the time. And at the same time, it's a woman that has to control her emotions, you know, because she is in a male-dominated world and she has to show them, you know, how smart and how strong she is. And if she starts crying at the drop of the hat, nobody's really going to pay too much attention to her. That doesn't mean she doesn't cry inside, that doesn't mean she's a character with a lot of emotional baggage. So as an actor, I take it step by step and I'm very, very precise with everything.